Hey, yo, where Nick at? Back there in the cut. J.D. Davidson, I mean, he's one of the most athletic, dynamic guards in the country at any level. I, I think he's got ridiculous upside, I think, with the way that we play. TV, they played, man. They played. Man, we in Brantley, Alabama. <laughs> hey, get the bag. No, this is your will. Brother P. Why? Why? Nick in the cut. Nick in the cut. Nick in the Bird TV. Is this good eats? Good eat, man. Good eat. <laughs> Bro, for Bella. Bro, what are you on? Go. Game. He ain't game. The hairline. Mark Cat, Mark Cat. Go, Jay. <laughs> This will be in late. <laughs> And if you're getting ready for any weekend plans that might take you outside, good news is we have very little rain in the forecast. And also, we have some seasonal warmth as well. Tonight, not that much different from the past several nights. We're on either side of 70 as we wake up early Saturday morning. It's a mild, quiet evening with a little bit more cloud.
Every single time, you got to step with your what? Stay right there. Left, right, left, right. Left, right, left, right. Left, right. I sleep in with you. We go all night. Here, shot. All right, what's full speed, coach? I don't know. On this whole drill, which one's the full speed? Drill, dude. It's another one. Drill, okay. Rip, full speed, what, what happens with the shot? All right, what else is coming? Get out. No, you got to get out. This is a yeah. So is that game speed? Yeah, it's yeah. Get out. yeah, so it's only one part that's chill, two parts. Is the shot and you going to what? Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. <laughs> all right, let's see. Oh, whoa. Oh, good. Good. Come back, come back. Remember, you're in the game right now. You know the player's coming, but you can't. You ain't gonna be able to move that down to line. Yeah. Yeah! Now cut off. Yes, my God, that's perfect. Once you make three, when I get it, coach is gonna move out the way. You're gonna come here. You're gonna dunk it. Once you dunk it, the beast is what? You going back to shooting and not defense. So once you dunk it and you jog back here, what does the beast have to do? Okay, you only gotta do that twice. So you're only making six shots and two dunks. So the, remember, once you make the third three, you're gonna get out the way. You're gonna have a ball. I'm gonna pass it to him. You're gonna rip, you're gonna be the beast. You're gonna come back, calm, you're gonna make three again. You know, been ready to come here since I committed, so we feel just here. Got to work, so you know, we here now.
Wake up, 5.45, five 6 o'clock every morning. No morning routine, get to the gym, seven, I mean, see you Thursday. Start working out, 7 o'clock, you know, 7 to 9. Then, you know, come back, take a shower. And you got class at 10 to 11.45, all for the rest of the day. So you get workout, 6 o'clock, another one at 9.30. Oh God, you pay $10 for you crazy? Why I that out of I heard you had two breakfasts this morning. No, I, just had, I just had two mad grillers. Got about $12, 60 cents left. I need that. Whoa. 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 JV, we need it. Yes, sir. Is that all your gear in that bag? Yeah, I ain't taking it. I ain't taking it out. But you got my style. You know, gotta have these snacks. Oh. Okay. Best candy.
Take me a shower, Why do you think it's been an uh, easy adjustment for you? Um, like you know, been doing it for a while now, so. What's up? It's a hell, Nick. I go run in the morning. <laughs> yeah, I go run in the morning, so. Name is not not a big adjustment, but you know, just adjusting to it, to my body type. You feel me? Just tight like that. So it's no big adjustment. Just same thing. Just. One is a different mindset, right? Yeah, I'm outside, I think with the way that we play, the floor opened up with the speed that we play with, with his athleticism, I think he's gonna be really hard to guard. I think with the shooting that we're gonna put around him, uh, he's gonna keep the floor spread. I think he needed to go to a spot that, you know, or I shouldn't say he would have been good anywhere he went, but it helped him to go to a place that values shooting like we do to keep the floor spread, to keep the lane open for him. But he, he's gonna, I mean, you put him and Quinterly out there, it's gonna be hard to keep the two of those guys in front, front, of, uh, in front of you. And then, you know, shoot, you also saw we've got Shackleford can drive the ball, you know, we've got other guards that. Primo's really starting to come on with me. You know, we've got some really good guards that are going to play well together that can all pass, dribble, and shoot. So, but yeah, I'm excited to coach JD. I, I mean, his highlight real. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty ridiculous to be honest with you. So we'll, we'll get some uh, we'll get some plays drawn up for him. That's for sure. But uh, as far as as far as the um, the scheduling goes, we, uh, me and Adam have to sit down and go through it. Uh, you know, some of the games that were postponed. You're a lot of Nick. Just catch up. Can you add uh, uh, eight count nugget? You want a frosty, man? Vanilla frosty? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Okay. Yeah, mint shake. Oh. You want whipping cherry or no? Uh, no cherry. Here you go. Is it? Um, be better than I was yesterday. Um, don't don't be don't get high, don't get low. Straight on. Hell, solid year. I won a championship. I I just take the year one of the best years I played. Can you improve upon it next year? Oh yeah, I'm more definitely improve a lot next year. With me, and I got me and got some coat. Coat stuff coming back. We go work hard to get back there. If you don't win, you're gonna shave your head. No, I ain't gonna do that. <laughs> Why not? No, I ain't go. I ain't promising nobody that I'm cutting my hair. How long? How long is that growth? Second grade. You gotta just trim here, trim there, or no cut whatsoever. Yeah, low cut and then second grade. I just body going out. So you haven't cut it at all. No. <laughs> yeah, so for the first time in, uh, I believe, program history, Alabama just signed back-to-back -to -back top 10 recruiting classes, uh, assuming this uh, class continues to go how it's going. Um, and what was arguably, I think, the biggest recruiting victory in all of college basketball, they won the commitment of J.D. Davidson, uh, five-star point guard, number three in the country, number 13 player overall. Um, I think he was the highest rated prospect in the state of Alabama since DeMarcus Cousins in 2009. Uh, also the highest since Colin Sexton for Alabama in 2016. Um, he possesses really just unlimited potential. He's, he's got a great handle of things. He's got a developing jump shot, elite level vision. Um, he is probably the best athlete in the class. I, I don't know if I've ever seen a better dunker in person. Um, he could be one and done type guy. Uh, they also add Deshaun Holt. Uh, I believe he's the number 102nd overall player in the country. Uh, he's a high level shooter. I got the ability to guard multiple positions using his unique athleticism. That sounds good. Jordan, how did that battle go? I know Auburn was very, very hopeful that they would get uh, Davison as well. But J.D. Davison ends up coming to Alabama. And those are players, uh, to be quite honest with you, that Alabama has not gotten over the years. Um, they, they haven't won these type of recruiting battles. So I got to give Nate Oates a ton of credit for being able to beat out Bruce Pearl and the rest of the country for this point guard. Uh, how did they do it? I've followed J.D. Davidson since his freshman year um, at Calhoun. Antoine Petway's been on him uh, for a long time. Um, Antoine's been, been his guy, and J.D.'s been Antoine's guy. So getting on that early, kind of like how um, Avery Johnson was on Colin Sexton first, really pushed them over the top. Um, J.D. Davison was, was grew up an Alabama fan and obviously um, loves Alabama. So that helped a lot. But once the big guys come calling, you, all bets are off. Um, I know Duke was thinking about getting involved, Kentucky. Um, but in the end, it was always going to be you know either Alabama or Auburn. And Memphis was in there pretty good as well. So Alabama really won that because they had the best relationship with JD. 
Um, I know his family wanted to stay close to home to watch him, um, which could have been Alabama or Auburn. But just in the end, Antoine Petway just having the consistency of, you know, being that guy that JD would come talk to um, on a consistent basis. So I know I've seen him since, like I said, his freshman year. And I knew once I saw him live that he was going to be arguably the top player not only the state, but in the country as well. And he developed and I mean, it paid off for him. And it paid off for Antoine as well, too. Everything, With you, everything you do, everything you do. Everything. Like, he go left all the time. Maybe he like to go right all the time. Two he he, he, two, he always he go two right bounce. He like one bounce. Like, right, bro, it, 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 it's different it. now. Cause you know that football is even worse. Yeah, you know, y'all gotta learn everything. Yeah. It's like a test, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh! They're talking, but that's chill, man. I ain't free party. Yeah, you gotta park on the back, though. Late night. Yeah. Time needs to wake up tomorrow. Yeah, hey, about 5 45, 6 o'clock. It's gonna pay off. Yeah, most definitely gonna pay off now. Gonna pay off. What you say? Just like this. Bring that barbecue over the top. He eating cute and shit. Huh? Mm-hmm. White barbecue sauce. Regular barbecue sauce. White barbecue sauce. It's good. <laughs> hey, you wanna do it right now? Oh, yeah. Bro, put something on it, bro. I'm, I see. Okay. Oh, no, I'm up here. I'm chilling. Look, I've been say y'all y'all been hooping that season. Yeah. You know, trying to get stronger, faster, quicker and all that in the weight room. And you know, on the court, you just working everything. So working, passing, shooting, dribbling, pick and roll, all that, it's just basketball. So, you know, we just work. Twenty-four hour access to the gym. It's even better here because you know you got GAs and trainers come get rebounds and stuff for you. You don't have to hit nobody else. You just gotta hit them up. Like, hey, you come rebound. It's no problem. You feel me? Then you have the re the recovery center. It's the best recovery center you can have. Like, you gotta love college for that. Cold tub, hot tub, uh, nail techs, and all that for you. And you have. It's why it's just everything about college you would love about. <laughs> I'm starting to eat more, but still trying to stay with my body, not getting like body fat bigger, but muscle type bigger. And I'm just starting to eat more fruit too. Um, 
protein shakes too. Um, just make sure you have some on your stomach like before the workouts and make sure you eat after the workout. So mostly just stand up, don't be on no empty stomach type. You feel me? You just gonna be on no stuff like that. Radio, 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 radio.